So last night was the uh, special election in Ohio and a few other places. Um, in Ohio, the 12th district, which is a Republican district, uh, the congressman resigned to go into business. So they had to replace him for three months. And um, so Troy Balderson ran against Danny O'Connor. Balderson, the Republican, O'Connor, the Democrat. Balderson won the race. Um, some haven't called it yet, but it looks to me like that's what it's going to be by about a half percentage point. Now, is this a big deal? Not really, because the two run against each other in November again. All right, for a two-year term. So this is just sets up Balderson in there um, for three months in the House of Representatives. But in the media, uh, and I didn't watch a lot of it because I don't want to get depressed before I speak with you, but I saw a little, and I knew it. Well, the Republicans should have won a lot more than they did. The turnout was 200,000. It was very low. People are on vacation. They're not thinking about this stuff. All right? So I'm not making excuses for the Republican. I don't know this guy. I don't know uh, Balderson. I don't know O'Connor. I don't follow local politics in Ohio. But I, I knew that they were going to spin it like this was a, a Democratic win because anything that makes Trump look bad is what the press is going to do. You know it. I know it. Everybody knows it. 